name is Malik Hayes. I was born in 1999. I stay in South Central LA. Uh, my dad stays on 97. My mom stays on 87. And I take the bus to school in Woodland Hills. The bus ride is an hour and 45 minutes. It's pretty far, but I got used to it. Malik, you're ugly. <laughs> Girlfriends, okay, I've had maybe, maybe 25 to 30 out of my whole life. One girlfriend in second grade, her name was Brittany, and like, she was in foster care. And like, I used to date her like on and off, but like, it was one time that I was only in the second grade, so like, I was crying. She broke up with me to go out with my best friend. So I beat him up, and then I got her back. Only God can really judge you, but like, you still get mad like if people talking about you, but no one really talks about me because I talk about them back and they get mad. How much is it? In my opinion, the best way to impress a girl, gotta go get a lineup from a good barber, haircut, Get some new clothes, new shoes, clean yourself up real good. I talk to her without my friends around. Cause I don't want like them laughing at me or anything. They're not letting me graduate on stage because it's mostly my fault that I let my grades start slipping, but it was my fault that I didn't try. Cause I still get my diploma and like no one really know if I walk the stage or not. Cause they'll just see my diploma and just off tops think I walk the stage unless I tell them. Now come back to <laughs> This week the teacher said that I didn't have to come to school because the grades were already out and it's just gonna be graduation practice this week. So it was no point in me coming. And I was just gonna be sitting in the dean's office the whole like week. But I'm excited that I'm going to Vegas. There's a lot of things that I knew that you probably guys don't even know. A lot of things I know. George Bush had something to do with 9-11. And Osama Bin Laden is not dead. <laughs> After middle school, my mindset is to pass all grades in high school night. 10th, 11th, and 12th, and then going to college. You pray to God and go to church that he'll keep you on this earth. I don't know. You never know. There's nothing to really be excited about because you never know what's going to happen. Don't know if I'm going to be here. And on earth, great things happen, you never know.